I ready for this? What if they kill another dog? That would be like my third one this freaking summer in, of commentaries. Or I guess it's fall now. Well, I guess keep the dogs coming, I guess. I'm just kidding. I take it back. I really hope that the pit bull stays alive. What's up guys, it's Ange, and today we're gonna be watching John Wick Chapter 2. Honestly, like, I couldn't tell you what this one would be about after watching the first one. I can anticipate a lot of action, but does, like, another person just get on his nerves and then mayhem just ensues i don't know i guess i'll find out i'll shut up now <laughs> before we begin make sure you guys hit the subscribe button if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all my content i post three times a week follow me on all my social media all my handles will be in the description below and follow me on twitch i live stream every sunday tuesday and thursday if you guys want to check out the full-length commentary to this movie make sure you check out my patreon page where you can gain full access to that and future movie slash tv shows that i do on this channel Alrighty, y'all let's jump straight into the commentary oh god are we starting at the end again all right actually this looks very much in the middle of something mr Mr. Wick? Is that you? Jonathan? Oh, duh. You know what? He has an advantage because he can like fit through spaces like that. Okay, aerial VU. I see you, camera. We're doing bigger, better things on this one. I like it. Oh! I didn't even anticipate that. You okay? You definitely broke a leg or an arm or a rib cage or like all of the above, you know? What did he do to you? Ah, I don't need to see this. We get it, you like cigars. So with all due respect, are you sure this is our best option? Why can't we just correct because the problem? Because my nephew killed a dog. Oh. And he stole a car. Stop. Which currently is among our inventory. It is John Wick's car. You guys still have the car? Sir, why don't we just give it back? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He killed my brother over his car and a puppy. Yeah, uh, 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 uh. The car I understand a little bit. It's a nice car, but like, yeah, maybe dozens of people's lives, whatever. But the dog? You're telling me that the puppy means nothing to you? So wow, this is really just taking place right after. Hey, yo, Keanu. The machina. <laughs> All this for a car, because you won't give him back his car. Like, is it worth it? Absolutely not. But would that make for a good film? No. So I'm okay with this. It is a nice car. I will give him that. It's a pretty sweet car. <gasps> All of this just for them to crash into your car? I'd be pissed off. I knew taxi drivers had side hustles. Taxi drivers in New York are like another level in terms of like they're actually badass. I don't know how they drive like that. You know, I don't want to say anything, but like I think your car's <laughs> banged up just a little bit. <laughs> There's almost no point in bringing it in for repair. Like just buy a new one. Oh God. Oh no, 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 no. Dude, now you don't have a windshield. Oh, he's going to kick you. Oh, literally Ow! John, you're relentless. Where did he learn to do all of this? Am I ever gonna get backstory here? Probably not, right? That's honestly the most tragic thing. Again, incoming cars, his biggest weakness, I swear. We gotta work on that. I don't know how, but like, you're gonna have to learn to practice somehow, John Wick. You're slacking. I take it back. That was wonderful. Not the kneecaps. That hurt me. So now are you happy that you kept his car from him? Probably not. Oh, I, uh, I get, oh, you're, you're right. You got me there. <laughs> me. You're not getting into that car. Why are you even trying, sir? Look at it. What an intro sequence. Pure action. Well, I'm glad you made it home. Oh, is it because he has like an emotional attachment to the car too because of his wife? So was it really just because of like all because of that card? You know, I wouldn't be surprised. John Wick is just a sentimental boy. That's what it really is, right? That's what it comes down to. <gasps> the pitbull. Hi, dear. What a good boy. Oh, poor man is still grieving. Hello? Who are you? Oh, hey! What do you think? I can fix this. You can fix that? Oh, yeah, this is when you freaking smashed your basement floor. Well, time to reseal, I guess. 
So like, every time you need to get stuff from that chest, do you sledgehammer it open? That's so much hassle. But I mean, anything for little Daisy, am I right? <laughs> Who could that be? Do I know you? Santino. Oh, I do know you. Hey, does he have a name? No. You didn't name him yet? But he's like grown. Did he not name it because he doesn't want to get as attached to it like the other one in case he dies? No one gets out and comes back without repercussions. If not for what I did, you wouldn't be here. Oh, so you owe him one? A marker is no small thing, John. For a man to grant a marker to another is to bind a soul to a blood oath. Find someone else. Wait, so what is this, though? What is this? Hmm? I don't know. This is your blood. Oh. You could have used strawberry jam. I'm not that guy anymore. You are always that guy, John. True. Do you see what you did to that guy because he had your car? I'm sorry. How can you say no to those eyes? Let's hear some John. Oh, he said confidence. He said see you soon because you will be working with me. So like you might as well take the job. It's not like you're not good at what you do. You freaking went ham because of the dog in the car. Like, come on. Oh my god, you're about to blow up my home because I wouldn't work with you? What if you kill me? Now you're gonna get it, dude. You know how much sentimental value I have in this house? Forget the car. You blew up my home. But the dog! But but what about where's the where's the pit bull? Thank God the dog is okay. Oh, man, we're back here? He didn't even bring a bag this time. I mean, it's not like he has anything. <gasps> tai Lung. You're just a big, fat panda. What the hell were you thinking, giving a marker to a man like Santino D'Antonio? What did you think was gonna happen? I'm only hearing Tai Lung, and I'm fangirling. You dishonor the mark, you die. Kill the hold of the mark, you die. You run, you die. I have no choice. You can't kill him either? If you run, you die too? So the marker is literally an IOU. Come on, John, you're a man of your word. You can do this. Dang, you're really massaging my arms. Take your sweet time, girly. Oh, oh God, that was everywhere. You're thinking about it, aren't you? Thinking about what? How would you do it, I wonder? My hands. My hands. Why'd you say it like that, Keanu? He's a legend, but why? <laughs> I want you to kill my sister. You want what? me to kill Gianna D'Antonio? She's in Rome for her coronation. That's your IOU? Jeez. And it's international? 5903.5. <laughs> Waiting for him to leave because it's all just guns, probably. Oh, it's clothes. Just kidding. <laughs> It makes sense because all your clothes got burnt down. And it's a travel size chest. <laughs> wow, he really does not want to do this. I mean, this is just asking for his life too. Like, and he's in another country. Like, what are you going to do? Jimmy's not here. Jimmy can't help him. Jonathan. Uh, okay, of course people know him in Rome too. Sei qui per il Santo Padre. You here for the Pope? No, but arguably just as bad. All right then. He's like, thank God. Is a sommelier in? I have never known him not to be. You know, a simple yes would have sufficed. <laughs> Do you say that every time you mean yes? Good afternoon, Mr. Wick. I'd like a tasting. So this is where he gets all his stuff? 11.5 inch, compensated with an iron bonded bolt carrier. He can be saying anything and I'll be like, good, good, yep, yep, I like that. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Zero penetration. However, quite painful, I'm afraid. I mean, yeah, the impact would still hurt, right? But dang, you make bulletproof suits? What does his tattoo mean? I'll look it up one day, probably. <laughs> Definitely not. <laughs> I said that I couldn't even like hold in my laugh because I knew I wasn't gonna look it up. Okay, maybe I will. <laughs> Are you just watching him? What are you doing? Just staring? Oh, making sure that he's doing his job, maybe? Oh my God, is it you that we need to kill? Mr. Raccone. You can't just take what is right for Nothing was taken. Those among your own came to us with these territories. What is yours is now ours. I don't really understand what that means. But he, she's definitely reaping the benefits of something that's supposed to be his, I guess. I'm sure I'll figure it out with time. That's your bathroom? Is that just like a jacuzzi in the middle of the room? Dude, forget the party. I would just vibe out in here. Oh, uh, hello? I'm Wick. John. You know me too? How on earth does everyone know me? There was a time not so long ago in which I'd considered as friends. 
Oh, that's so sad. But I gave my marker to your cousin, brother. This marker, was she worth the price that you now seek to pay? Oh, stab to the heart. Well, John's brutally honest. Santino will lay claim to my seat at the table. And you will have been the one who gifted it to him. Well, I gave him a marker, so sorry. What a beautiful dress. You know, you're dying, but at least you look good. Oh my God, don't take off the dress. Oh, keep it on. Keep it on. This is no time for a bath, ma'am. What are you doing, ma'am? I don't understand. I lived my life my way. And I'll die my way. My way. My way or the highway. Yo, you did John's work for him. John? Cassian? You working? You? Yeah. Thank God for your suit, man. Oh, right on stage two? Did the band not notice at all? Oh, jeez. Dead, dead. Another one dead, another one dead. Yes, the fast reload. It's so good. I want to learn how to reload that fast. You know, it's funny though. I think I'd be literally too scared to even hold it. But I want to know how to reload. Oh, sad. But he didn't kill. Well, I guess he ended her, but she started it. All right. Hello, who are you? Loose ends. Oh, her job is to kill him? <gasps> no! Weave, John, weave! <laughs> See? Dang, he used him and then he was gonna kill John? So rude. Oh, whoa. Again, something that I will mention with the camera work of this movie, like action sequences, I feel like, are so good at just switching the angles a million times to play camera tricks or just to like, keep it like really high energy high pumping but i really like how they a lot of the time just follow john and he does all the work you know like that whole hallway scene was literally just him and he killed like four guys or something but they held it sure it's handheld camera so it makes it a little shaky to make it more intense but i freaking love this dude how many men was that i couldn't even keep track it's like watching a video game honestly except he doesn't miss no room for human error because it's john wick and he's just perfect oh god you good, John? After a big fight scene, he's just like slightly hurt. No! <laughs> of course, the incoming cars, John. Come on. He's never really paying attention to the upcoming traffic. Ooh, not down the stairs. Ow. Ooh, wee. And we're back down the stairs. Oh, God, you guys are really just rolling yourselves down at this point. Yo. This is crazy. What is going on? And I love how there's like no music either. This is just straight up a fight. He reloaded using the back of his knee. No way. Gentlemen. Yes. Oh yeah, hotel is off limits, right? May I suggest a visit to the bar? You know what? Y'all are about to have a drink right now. So what if you guys just both agree not to kill each other though? Like, come on. You killed my ward. Someone I was close to. An eye for an eye, John. So you're gonna kill someone that I'm close to? Good thing I'm literally close to no one anymore. I'll make it quick. I hate to break it to you, but that fight wasn't quick. It's It seems tough to get to John Wick. That's all I'm saying. Sound very confident for a man that's about to die. I understand if you're upset, but what kind of man would I be if I didn't avenge my sister's murder? John said, I'm done with you, dude. <laughs> Could you let management know I'll be checking out in the morning? Oh, John says he is done. Are you done for? Is John mad at you now? I'd like to open an account. Name on the account? John Week. State of contract. Open. This is literally the same thing in the first movie, too. How, like, basically when John hangs up on your call, you know he is mad at you. So get a contract out. <laughs> to all the assassins out there. <laughs> oh my god, this is literally global. Excuse me? Probably everyone knows who freaking John Wick is. If Mr. Wick isn't dead already, he soon will be. I doubt we will see him again. Do you know? Ian's like, yeah, you're done for, bro. John is literally coming after you. Dude, of course they're all on the street too, the heck? He's like, didn't even give me a second to check out. 
Owie. Yeah, she's like shot you twice in the freaking abdomen. It's always your abdomen, bro. Well, I guess that's a good thing, right? So long as it's not a vital organ, am I right? Jeez, how many people are in this business? The pencil! Yeah, that's where you messed up. Who uses pencils nowadays? Had to bring in the pencil. I mean, come on. <gasps> Dang, all these people are seriously, though, risking their lives for $7 million. God, you can literally never know who's coming after him. Oh, God, not again. Give me a break. No way they're just doing this casually. There's no way no one's hearing the bullet hitting the walls. Dang, it kind of sucks that, like, this entire station is in white. They're gonna go catch the train together? Well, this is awkward. Owie! Oh, oh, that's my rib cage. Hey, I thought you said you were gonna make it quick. This doesn't look quick to me. You thought you could be quick with John Wick. That's what you get for trying to murder him. The sanitation crew are assassins too? Is that what they are? I don't even know what to call them, to be honest. Hey man, you got a quarter? Oh, you're part of it too? Did you get fixed up? Yay, thank God. You should have bled out and been so weak by then. But you know, we're not gonna question it because you're John Wick and you're pretty much indestructible. <laughs> uh, am I watching The Matrix right now? Mr. Wick doesn't remember, but we met many years ago. Yeah, on the set of The Matrix. This movie just switches out and like they're all living in The Matrix. Your contract went wide, John. Seven million dollars. We're going to Applebee's after this. You could do better than Applebee's. I need you to move me. Get me to him. Why the f*** would I do that? When I can get seven million dollars and Applebee's. You can't beat the half-off apps, you know? Seven round capacity seven million dollars gets you seven rounds you owe me you don't want me owing you literally you do not want him to owe you do you not know what's happening to poor santin sand whatever his name is it's all because he owed him look where it's gotten him about to be dead probably most likely i don't know he only has seven bullets like even i think john wick can't do it with just seven bullets you're literally done for john wick is there and he's there for your head look what you made me do bro how's he gonna do it <laughs> that's seven Steal his gun you need it he got rid of those bullets really quickly a million around <laughs> Get juked, bro. The fact that you aren't sprinting for your life right now is everything to me. Come on, just run. We all know that you want to. Like, I know he's busy with a lot of, like, men, but he's coming through these rooms pretty swiftly, all right? So if I were you, you should run. Dude, not the mirrors. How did they do, like, it really mind boggles me how they do all these camera shots, but then they can't show the camera, which is probably so freaking annoying. So I really admire it when movies do like a room full of mirrors kind of thing. The marker is complete, John. You should have just run away. You wanted me back. I'm back. You put my name out for $7 million and you made me kill a friend. So no, I am not going to let this go. Dude, the mirrors might probably trip people up like crazy. Give me your gun, sir! I need it! Thank God these mirrors rotate, I guess. And are bulletproof? Like, what, what are these mirrors made out of? That bullets don't shoot through it. Or mirrors like that. I mean, I don't know. What are mirrors made out of? What are mirrors? Dang, I can't believe he's doing this right now. He only had a seven bullet advantage. I really can't get over the action of this film. It's so good. Dude, the amount of choreography that all of these sequences must like entail and think about it they're utilizing so much of the actual set that they have to like really hone this down and practice it and time it at the new modern he's like fine by me <laughs> Ooh, again see look at the mirror like the camera's following them by using the floor too that's epic oh oh we oh she's badass dang through the hand and the heart you got any more bullets on you though? Thanks, hun. Well, that was the last of your helpers. What are you gonna do now? Oh, you're just gonna hide in here? Excuse me, one room forever, please? Mind pouring me one too? This is what you get for blowing up my home. Jonathan, just walk away. Yeah, Jonathan, walk away. <laughs> what have you done? Broke the rules, I'm sorry. 
I'm out of here. Does that mean that he has no more membership? Does that mean he dies? What does that mean? John, you could have just waited till he left the building. <gasps> Hi, bud. Yeah, let's go, pupper. John, you good? Like, I don't want to say anything, but like, I think you just really threatened your own life there. You just broke the rules. Did you see what happened to Perkins in the first movie? You're dead. You're just gonna kill everyone? That can't work. Oh man, he went back home, but he doesn't have a home to come back to. John Wick is just a poor sentimental boy. He needs out of this life ASAP Rocky. But now he can't do that because he broke the freaking goddamn rules. Mr. Wick. Yes? What are you doing here? If you would be so inclined. Oh, like they're gonna ki go kill him? Stop. He's literally going to his death. You're not gonna make the dog witness this. I'm gonna actually cry. I'm sorry. I know I messed up. The Camaro's double Santino's open contract has gone international. You killed a man on company grounds, Jonathan. You leave me no choice but to declare you excommunicado. Then why am I not dead? Because I deemed it not to be. Crazy. You literally control the world. You're literally just world rule leader. You have one hour. You might need this down the road. Tell them all. Whoever comes, I'll kill them all. Still? I mean, I, I, I guess I respect it, but like, you're gonna kill them all? Just to save your own life? He's got one hour to run away. Well, here we go. Another freaking account on John Wick. He did show a little bit of a favoritism, though. Giving him an hour to, like, run away. He didn't do that to Perkins. Perkins was just... <sniffs> Bro, you're gonna be living your whole life in paranoia now. One hour. Yeah, you got one hour. I would be running, too. There's no way all these people are in this business. Oh, we, we for sure know this guy is. You're in this alone now, John. No more friends. At least you have your pitbull buddy, though. Look at your little good boy. That's it? I don't even get to see where he goes off to? That's all that they give me. Seriously. It's so good, though. Uh, this is fun. This is really fun to watch. The story is ge generally the same in this one with the vengeance route, but I just love the action. It's just so fun to watch. I know he's, like, brutally murdering a bunch of people, but it's just entertaining he also like really talks super intense like but it's very batman-esque except darker even darker than batman i do think i like the first one better but obviously because it's the first one but it's fun wow what a time what do you guys think about this movie when it first came out were you a fan of the sequel because i really did not mind this and i also like how they really upped the skill set i guess in this one like we got that pencil fight scene that mirror like fight scene sequence like those were really really cool and obviously just triple the amount of men that he has encountered and fought since the first one. Huge round of applause to Keanu Reeves. You gotta be in a huge mental space and physical shape to be able to do that. So kudos to you, man. You freaking killed it. What a wild, wild movie. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed that commentary, make sure you leave it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all my content. And don't forget to check out my last video. If you guys wanna check out the full length commentary to this movie, make sure to check out my Patreon page where you can gain full access to that and future movie slash TV shows that I do on this channel. Alrighty, y'all. Have the best day ever and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Okay, bye, okay, bye, okay, bye.